Hi everyone, back at Shatterbringers 5.3 and this is going to be our crafting rotation for the three star items such as the doublet of crafting. In order to give myself some extra stat points and some uh, extra CP this is going to simplify the whole process because what I'll do in this uh, section of the crafting is I'm just going to equip the soul crystal to my weaver, my leather worker, and my alchemist because that way I can do all of these pieces for the left side with the additional stats. So that'll make it real easy. Now after I get this part of it crafted, my left side, it's going to be pretty much a piece of cake to do the tools because I'm not doing the main hand, I'm just going to use the relic tool. So it'll be pretty easy to do the tools, the offhand, and the other accessories on the right side. Make it super simple, because I would like to have as much CP as possible to do this. Now this rotation is going to use 627 CP. My base CP is only 532, and I know a lot of crafters have more than that. So the 629 is not hard to hit, and I'm doing it with just the Blood Bula base. I could do it with the other CP buff that gives 105 craftsmanship and 70 CP rather than 64. That would give me six more CP here, up to what, um, gosh, 635, something like that? That's crazy. All of these materials like the dust court cloth and the uh, leather here are real easy to do with an easier rotation and I'll put the rotation on the macro page for you but let's do this this doublet of crafting we're starting out with 629 CP okay I'm going to just start with three dissolvents because I only have one normal quality but I think you could do it with two and we'll begin here we're going to be starting our quality at three percent and I think that's just plenty about 4700 so let's begin here. In a moment I'll take you to the macro page where we have the 35 durability macros for the dissolvent and the other, you know, the older 35 durability macro for the leather and uh, the other, you know, the cloth and the other items. Okay, I'm at 19% on my first phase of it. Let's push the second little macro button. 19 is pretty good. I think that should get me 200 real easy. Ah, 96. How about that? Oh well. Might need to add in one more high quality mat. I'm not quite sure how the RNG went on this because I didn't watch it super carefully. You probably know more about it than I do. <laughs> and there we are. A nice high quality doublet of crafting. Alright, just to demonstrate the difference between the facet piece and uh, the newer piece, the doublet. I went ahead and uh, melded this with uh, some control and craftsmanship. It only had uh, room for one point of CP and I'm not going to sweat the one point of CP. With the facet set and the um, soul crystal of course, we're at 2573 craftsmanship, 2463 control and 547 on the CP. Let's look at the difference here. From 2573, 2463 to 2614 and 2497. That's a real nice increase. So I think you can see after you only do a couple of pieces, you'll be able to knock out everything else so much easier. Right now I only have three macros on here. One is the 35 durability, three star rotation for patch 5.3 and the 35 durability 3 star for patch 5.2 like the dust court cloth, the leather, cobalt alloy, ingots, etc, etc. And then our 70 durability 3 star items for patch 5.3. Uh, this will generally get you to 85% uh, or better on your quality provided you're at uh, around 24 I think I was at 2463 base stats and then buffed with the uh, high quality Blood Bula Bays and some uh, Cunning Craftsman Syrup. 
But uh, that'll get you to where you need to be. Be sure to use your trial synthesis before you actually do any of these rotations because that way you won't blow any of your synthesis and you won't waste any materials. That's always a real good thing. All right. Appreciate you watching. Hope to see you in the next video. Please join us on Discord. There's a link below the video channel for this page and a Discord invitation.